What's up, guys? It's JCM92 coming at you again with another tier list. Uh, if you haven't heard, May has abandoned Ethan Ralph and stolen the baby and fled the JFK International Airport. She was taking a. Tr she was, they were supposed to be going to Rome for like a honeymoon, and then they landed in JFK. And Ralph said they were arguing on the way there, but he didn't expect it to be a big deal. They get to JFK, which is in you know New York. It's near where her father is, and then she just disappears with the baby. So now nobody knows what's happened. Ralph has deleted tweets about this. Uh, May is MIA, and they, it looks like the divorce saga may be happening a little bit sooner than we expected because they just got married like literally two weeks ago and a little bit more. However, I want to help her get over this loss as quickly as possible. So I'm coming up with a list of people that I think May could end up with, and I'm going to rank them on this this tier list. It says tier list name up here. I should actually probably change that to uh to be something else so that it doesn't look so fucking lazy. So let's swap that out. We're going to grab font. Let's let's make it Quattro Cinco because that's uh that's the goodest font. And we'll say who and we'll say in white so we can actually read it. Who, we'll try again to make this white so that we can actually read it. And it will say, who may should get with now. We're actually going to make this bold because it's the title and it should be bold. Perfect. Okay, here we go. We're going to start with our, our list. Um, let's, get, let's get some easy ones out of the way first. Uh, we got Medicare here. Now, what could... I am aware that Medicare... Is married already so that's already like a point against this ship happening may is not asian so there's low synergy here however may could potentially do things for for medicare and it would be pretty funny um so we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll be nice and we'll say that's a d tier ship i'm sure may would be very enthusiastic about it even if she was like a sister wife even if she wasn't like the proper wife but we'll go ahead and put that in the d uh, and then we got Rambot. This is another kind of... Tr I, I said I should start with the easy ones, but now I'm kind of tripping myself up. Rambot is also married. However, Rambot is like a neo-Nazi white supremacist who's married to a Jew. And uh, I think they have kids together, but he doesn't seem very happy in his marriage because he gets drunk and cries to Ralph about how much he hates his wife. Um, however... May would probably feel really smart in a relationship with Rambot, which is a point in her favor, because she's probably never felt smart in a relationship with anybody ever. Um, they both like anime, and uh, May is Italian, which is ostensibly white, depending on who you ask. So I'm going to go ahead, and actually, I'm going to rate Rambot as a C tier. and put that above, Jim. Now... Now, someone truly easy. This is Aquaman. This is from the latest movie. I don't have a picture of this guy. There is a guy that has been simping for May since they were in like college together. And this was the guy that worked at the aquarium. And Ralph threatened to get this guy fired. Uh, but this guy is like an OG simp for May. One of her true loves. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to throw him up in the A tier for Aquaman. Uh, actually, you know what? Yeah, you know, I'll keep him in A. I'll... I'll keep him an A. I'm really deciding to drop him down to a B, but I'm gonna be nice. I'm gonna keep him an A. Jesse from Pot Awful, easy F tier because this would actually give him notoriety. This is the only person that May could fuck that would have less clout than than her. And Jesse from Pot Awful needs no clout ever from anyone. Easy F tier pick. Now, uh, someone she could gain clout from is dick masterson now dick masterson is in a long-term relationship uh but he likes he likes young girls may is kind of youngish i don't know what his opinions are on single moms i don't think i've ever heard him mention a single mom ever in like his podcast that i've heard uh but that would be really funny if he hooked up with may he doesn't really have any strings with his current girlfriend to keep keep her around um, the main thing is that Dick hates children. So while it would be really funny, um, the, the kid definitely complicates factors. And I just don't think that they have anything, any interest. Like he likes women that are extremely like 
gifted with physical attributes that may completely lack. So uh, unfortunately, I'm going to have to put that in the E tier just due to unlikeliness, lack of synergy, and uh, and then so on. Now we have some better options here. I think these are all going to be higher up. Chris Chan, of course, uh, is someone that May has already met. Uh, when when May saw Chris Chan in real life at the parking lot of that apartment building, she cried out to him, Chris, we love you. I think she said that literally. And she said, we're big fans. And then she also said, don't worry, Chris, I also have gender issues. So Chris, as a, as a trans-identifying lesbian, would be all for having a lesbian's relationship with uh, Amanda. Um, Amanda would gain a ton of notoriety from being Chris's girlfriend. And uh, the baby, I don't think Chris would be good with kids. I'm going to be real with you. I, knowing what I know about Chris, I don't think that's going to happen. However, uh, May can just take care of them both as children. So we're going to go ahead and throw Chris up in the B tier. Um, because I think they like anime and shit. I think they would just be great for each other. Really healthy dynamic. And picks are getting more and more interesting now. I, uh, I think I'll weed out um, Godwinson. Now, Godwinson has everything that a woman can want in a man. Uh, he's rich. He's funny. He's charismatic. He's in shape. Downsides with Godwinson, he's British. That's kind of a deal breaker for almost everyone. Uh, I also think that Godwinson is a psychopath that stabs homeless people in the middle of the night like American Psycho. Um, however, he might he might be willing to to bone May just because it would be funny. Uh, however, I don't think that's actually likely, and May might die as a result. So, since I'm trying to like make like a real relationship here, I'm gonna have to go ahead and throw Godwinson in the D tier next to Medicare. Because uh, I think she she would end up in a dumpster. Uh, let's continue on. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and throw up uh, an S tier. I think. Ooh, I don't know actually if I should put PPP as an S tier or an A tier. Here's my thoughts with PPP. PPP is a homosexual, so he needs a beard. That beard can be May. Uh, I don't think that she would be interested in having sex with PPP, but it would make PPP look straight. It would give uh, uh, Ma Amanda some sort of stability to have this man earning income for them. Um, she could potentially help with the writing for the Kino Casino because God knows they need it. And additionally, I think that Andy Worski could be considered the godfather for little baby Rosie. And he could just refer to him uh, himself as the godfather from for, forever. And I think Andy Worski would be really happy calling himself the Godfather. And they would find it really funny to be raising Rosie, even if it is kind of like a stepfather, my girlfriend's daughter type situation. It would still it would be funny enough that I think a lot of people would forgive that. So I'm actually going to go ahead and I'm going to go throw PPP and the Godfather Andy Worski up in the A tier. I'm going to make him a little bit bigger because he is PPP and he's the biggest in the sector. Uh, on that note... Let's take a look at Faith. Faith, of course, is raising the other child of Ethan Ralph. Um, Faith is mentally ill, and I think May is too. I think they both like anime. I can, I'm considering anime a huge factor in this. If you like anime, you're already a, a massive consideration for, for being in a relationship with May. Um, I think that they could form a natural support structure. Matthew Vickers could pay for both of them, I think. It would be it would be good for them uh together. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go throw Faith up in the B tier. The only reason why uh, I don't throw it up in A is because there's no sexual dynamic between them. I think PPP could maybe you know do her a solid every so often because he's you know he's good at eating. And uh that would that would keep them from going insane. Uh, but now we got to really move on to, to the S tiers. Um, here we have Gator. Gator, I can I literally cannot think of a better match for May. They they both like anime. May has like that stick figure body type. He has this he has this waifu right. He has this waifu. I've actually gone ahead and I photoshopped Amanda into his waifu. Um, this is the actual waifu. It's from Steinsgate. So you can see that this this uh, waifu here, 
is uh, pretty close when when it's cosplayed as May. So I think that they could just dress up like each other, and Gator would be super happy like that. Gator would remember her birthday because he's very good at that. Um, Gator is an educated man. He can carry. He can keep down a job. He can hold commitments. And he probably can't do better than May. He actually posted a message on post saying, sorry, I can do better than May. I actually disagree with this. I'm not even being unironic. Um, I am going to throw Gator up at the tippy top as an S tier pick for Amanda. She should lock that boy down. Um, I think that their, their chemistry together, their love for anime makes them a power couple. Similarly, um, Flamenco is... Uh, kind of like a shittier version of Gator, I would say. I don't know how else to put it. Um, I think he has a diploma and he has a job. May does like Starbucks. Remember that when Rosie was first born, she would go to Starbucks like four times a day to get the fuck away from Ralph. And um, a as the as the uh, gift card connoisseur hoping to brighten a few sweeties days, nobody could brighten a day better than than flamenco i'm pretty sure so i'm putting him up on s tier on the right side of ppp because he's too big now i have i actually have a secret pick over here that i've been hiding this is digibro digibro uh she could always just go back to digibro the problem is that digibro is a tranny so for her own mental health i wouldn't recommend that um, but maybe they could hammer things out now that she's completely humiliated himself. I'm going to go ahead and put Digibro up on, on the B tier, you know, being a trans is sort of a big deal. And I actually have a super secret pick, Monday Matt. Hear me out. Matt has proven time and time again that he is there for his girlfriend's daughter. Everyone knows this. He's a devoted stepfather. God bless him. Uh, he can hold down a job, and I don't think he actually, like, he just doesn't seem like he cares about anything. I don't think he has any interest, so he would just be down for whatever. He would be down for watching whatever stupid shit that May wants to watch. And I'm, I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to throw Monday Matt up there as an A tier, as someone who I think May could get along with and who would, uh, she wouldn't love him, but she would learn to deal with him and to tolerate him. And that's what we're really looking for here. That's a uh, that's kind of the secret sauce. So, this is my final tier, my tier list. Um, hope that I've provided some insight. Hope I've given May something to think about in terms of prospects. Uh, I hope Gator grounds himself in reality. Cause come the fuck on, and uh, I'll catch you the next time. I'm making a tier list for. Oh shit! I forgot one. I I actually. Oh my god. Okay, hold up. I need to pull this up. I. <laughs> I was gonna make the uh make a joke about a different tier list and I reminded myself that I forgot Queen Cafals. Now let's now let's be honest here, okay. Um Queen Cafals is Ralph's one true love. It, Ralph went on and on about how much he loves Cafals, how much how beautiful Cafals is, how much he appreciates her hard work day in and day out to bring down the kiwi farms um however if may now keffels can't have kids the you know because of their their condition their lifestyle choice uh but they do want kids they've said that their their audience is like a bunch of kids to them so now now may finds herself in a position where she can get with ralph's one true love and provide children to queen kafals um, when Kefals cannot have any. So we're going to put Kefals up on the A tier as my, my last addition to this. Uh, that, can, uh, that for sure concludes my chart. I hope you have enjoyed this tier list. Keep check, keep, make sure to like and subscribe and keep checking back for more tier lists like this. Um, tell me who would you ship... In the comments below, tell me who would you ship Amanda Morris and her, her demon baby with. Let me know in the comments. I'm looking out. I'm looking. I'll favorite my favorites. Thanks a lot. Uh, see you when I see you. Peace.